Hello and welcome to my latest report from here in the Scottish Parliament. It's been a very busy week both in the Chamber and out with. I went along to Edinburgh University along with Sarah Boyack and other MSPs uh, to talk with students and councillors and other people about how the university and the community can integrate more. And that was a great initiative by the Students uh, Council there, the University Students Association. And uh, here in the Scottish Parliament, uh, I attended a meeting of the Public Audit Committee on Wednesday. It sounds a bit boring, but in fact it's a very vital committee. And on this occasion we were looking at mental health provision. And uh, we were uh, getting evidence from Glasgow, from Lanarkshire and from Highland. And it is becoming clear that there are more and more cuts coming to local authorities and to health boards because of the cutbacks by the SNP. And one of the areas, one of the very vulnerable and sensitive areas that is going to be affected is mental health. And I hope that uh, we'll see a debate on this subject in the main chamber of the uh, Scottish Parliament in the near future. I've also had a lot of concerns expressed to me about problems regarding homelessness, particularly for mentally ill people, but also generally here in Edinburgh. And I'm looking into this uh, uh, very deeply at the moment and will be able to report to you in more detail in the future. Uh, but again, a, a lot of the concentration here in, in Holyrood has been on schools. We had a visit from Primary 7 at uh, the Royal High Primary School and they were full of intelligent, uh, uh, r clever questions to Kenny McCaskill and myself. The other parties uh, didn't come along. But the main debate was on the school building programme where in spite of the fact that uh, the uh, SNP were represented by two uh, cabinet ministers, Fiona Hislop and, uh, and, and uh, John Swinney, they were completely outclassed and beaten in the argument by the front bench of the Labour, Liberal Democrat and, SN and uh, Tory uh, parties. The SNP were uh, at sixes and sevens trying to claim that they were building uh, schools when we know they're not. The only schools that are being built are those that were started under Labour and we've had two years of no school building. Uh, but it was interesting, we've just had the vote here uh, on Thursday evening at five o'clock and once again Fiona Hislop was beaten in a vote in the Scottish Parliament. She is being beaten again and again and again. How long can she continue as Cabinet Secretary with a constant defeat uh, here in the Scottish Parliament. Well, we're into recess for two weeks now and uh, there won't be anything to report uh, from the Scottish Parliament, but my fellow uh, MSPs and myself will all be busy still pursuing your concerns. And if you have any, please email or write to me here at the Scottish Parliament and I'll be back reporting again to you on events at Holyrood in three weeks' time. Bye for now.